Resistance is, I would say, one of the biggest challenges that we face in oncology. My name is Alistair Davies. I'm a principal scientist in Pfizer Oncology. You can think of resistance like a beautiful garden and these weeds start popping up. You'll go, you'll get some chemicals, you'll treat your garden, the weeds will go away. But if you look really closely, some of these weeds will start to come back because they have these subtle variations or subtle differences that make them stronger than the other weeds. When we treat patients with powerful anti-cancer medicines, they do a really great job at killing the drug-sensitive cells that sometimes make up the bulk of these tumors. But pockets or islands of these more resistant, these tougher cells uh, remain in the patient. And over time, they'll begin to grow and multiply and the cancer will come back. Drug resistance in oncology is really the evolutionary adaptation of cancer cells to these very potent targeted therapies that we've developed. But these subtle changes between different cancer cells are what really provides a substrate for resistant clones to emerge following therapy.